Imagine waking up, night after night, to the same dream. Welcome to the mysterious world of recurring dreams. These are dreams that repeat themselves with precision over a long period of time. They are like a record stuck on replay, always spinning the same story, the same characters, the same emotions. Some might say they are merely a glitch in our brain's nocturnal activity, but there's more to it than that. Recurring dreams are typically linked to unresolved issues or deep-seated emotional conflicts. They are our subconscious mind's way of waving a red flag, signaling that something within us needs attention. They are the echoes of our inner world, whispering secrets that we might not be ready to hear when we're awake. So, are you ready to delve deeper into the labyrinth of recurring dreams? Our dreams often weave intricate tales. Let's explore some real-life cases of recurring dreams. Consider the story of Sarah, a woman in her 30s. She repeatedly dreams of losing her teeth. The dream recurs almost every week, leaving her in a state of anxiety and fear. The distress from her dreams often bleeds into her waking life, causing her to constantly worry about her dental health. Now let's look at another example. Mike, a recent college graduate, has a recurring dream of failing an important exam. Despite having graduated with honors, this dream recurs at least twice a month, casting a shadow over his achievements and filling him with self-doubt. In both these cases, the dreams persist, and the emotional impact on the dreamers is significant. They feel the ripples of their dreams in their waking lives affecting their self-perception and emotional well-being. Or take the case of Lisa, a middle-aged woman, who dreams about a house. The house is always the same, an old abandoned mansion. She explores different rooms in each dream, but the mansion remains a constant. The dream is not scary but it leaves Lisa feeling melancholic and nostalgic each time she wakes up. Now you must be wondering what do these dreams mean, why do they recur? Are they random firings of the brain during sleep or do they hold deeper meanings tied to our subconscious? Recurring dreams such as these often signify unresolved issues or deep-seated emotional conflicts. They are like a broken record, repeating until the issue is addressed or the conflict is resolved. It's as if our subconscious is trying to tell us something to draw our attention to something we've overlooked or suppressed. Interesting, isn't it? How these dreams repeat, as if trying to convey a message. The realm of dreams has always intrigued psychologists. Let's see how they interpret recurring dreams. The labyrinth of the mind is a fascinating place and dreams are one of its most intriguing corners. For psychologists, recurring dreams are not merely repetition of images or scenarios. They are often seen as symbolic expressions of unresolved issues or conflicts that our conscious mind is struggling with. Imagine your mind as an iceberg. The tip above the water represents our conscious thoughts, while the vast expanse beneath the surface is our subconscious. Recurring dreams are believed to emerge from this submerged portion, carrying with them messages from our inner world that we may not be fully aware of during our waking hours. Psychologists often interpret recurring dreams as our mind's attempt to bring our attention to something important. It could be a lingering conflict, an unresolved issue, or a deep-seated emotion that we've been avoiding. The dream is like a persistent knock on the door, urging us to open up and address what's on the other side. Sigmund Freud, the father of psychoanalysis, viewed dreams as the royal road to the unconscious. He believed that our dreams, especially the recurring ones, are packed with symbolism that represents our unfulfilled desires and suppressed emotions. Carl Jung, another prominent figure in psychology, saw recurring dreams as a reflection of our personal and collective unconscious. He suggested that such dreams are a way for our psyche to communicate with us, offering insights about our inner conflicts and life challenges. However, interpreting dreams is not a straightforward process. It's like trying to understand a foreign language without a dictionary. The same dream symbol could mean different things to different people, depending on their personal experiences and emotional context. That's why psychologists recommend keeping a dream journal and paying attention to the feelings and thoughts that arise upon waking from a dream. Our dreams, it seems, are trying to tell us something we need to address. This understanding can empower us to confront our unresolved issues, face our fears, and ultimately, lead a more fulfilling life. Recurring dreams can peel back layers of our psyche. Let's analyze how these dreams reveal deep-seated emotional issues or life challenges. Diving into the depths of our subconscious, we often find that recurring dreams act as a mirror, reflecting unresolved issues or conflicts. They don't merely replay these scenarios but rather, they amplify, distort, and transmute them into symbolic narratives. Take for example the recurring dream of being chased. This is a common motif, and often signals a feeling of being threatened or overwhelmed in waking life. 
The pursuer in the dream might represent an unresolved issue, or a conflict that we're trying to avoid. It's a symbolic manifestation of the stress or anxiety that's chasing us in our daily lives. Similarly, dreams of falling often indicate feelings of insecurity or lack of control. If you're consistently dreaming of tumbling into the abyss, it might be your subconscious nudging you to address a situation in your life where you're feeling out of your depth. On a more positive note, recurring dreams can also reflect our aspirations and passions. A recurring dream of flying might indicate a desire for freedom, or a dream of acing a performance might reflect a deep-seated passion for the arts. It's crucial to note, however, that the interpretation of dreams is highly individual. What one symbol means to you might mean something entirely different to someone else. It's a personal journey of introspection, where you are the best interpreter of your dreams. The challenge lies in decoding these symbols and understanding what our subconscious is trying to communicate. It's like piecing together a puzzle, where each dream element represents a piece, and the completed image provides a deeper understanding of our emotional state and life challenges. Isn't it fascinating how our subconscious uses dreams to communicate? By delving into our recurring dreams, we can uncover and address emotional issues or life challenges that we might not even be aware of in our waking lives. It's a journey of self-discovery and understanding, one dream at a time. Dreams might seem cryptic, but they can be deciphered. Let's learn some techniques for interpreting dreams. Dream interpretation is an art, not a science. It's a process of decoding the messages our subconscious minds send us while we sleep. It's like learning a new language, a language of symbols and emotions. Firstly, it's essential to keep a dream journal. This allows you to record and remember your dreams. Write down your dreams as soon as you wake up, while they're still fresh in your mind. Note every detail, no matter how small or seemingly insignificant. Next, consider the context of the dream. What's happening in your life? Our dreams often reflect our waking lives, echoing our worries, hopes, and fears. Now let's talk about symbols. Dreams speak in a language of symbols. These symbols can be personal or universal. A personal symbol might be a childhood home or a specific person, while universal symbols like water or animals have general meanings in dream interpretation. But remember, interpretation is subjective. A symbol that means one thing to you might mean something entirely different to someone else. So it's important to consider what these symbols mean to you personally. Emotions are also crucial in dream interpretation. How did you feel during the dream? Were you scared, happy, or confused? Your emotions can provide insight into what your dream is trying to tell you. Dream interpretation can also involve identifying patterns. Are there recurring themes or symbols in your dreams? These could be pointing to unresolved issues or conflicts in your life. Finally, give yourself time. Dream interpretation is not a quick process. It's a journey of self-discovery, patience, and understanding. It's about piecing together the puzzle of your subconscious mind. So start a dream journal, reflect on your waking life, identify symbols and emotions, look for patterns, and most importantly, be patient with yourself. Dream interpretation it seems is a journey of self-discovery. So, why should we pay attention to our recurring dreams, you might ask? Well, recurring dreams are like an unread email in your mind's inbox. They keep popping up until you take the time to understand and address them. These dreams are not random, they're a reflection of our deepest concerns, unresolved issues, and emotional conflicts. Our subconscious mind uses recurring dreams as a tool to communicate with our conscious mind. It's a fascinating dialogue that can reveal a lot about our emotional state. By analyzing these dreams, we can uncover hidden fears, unresolved feelings, and even potential life challenges. Moreover, understanding these dreams can guide us towards personal growth and emotional healing. They can help us navigate the complex labyrinth of our emotions and make sense of our thoughts and feelings. Remember, understanding your dreams is understanding yourself. Sweet dreams everyone.